Hey guys, it's Bales here to report on the top TV spins for the month of February. Nothing too shocking to report on in regards to last month's data. Obviously, February is a shorter month, so we're seeing a little bit lower spins across the board. Camp Lejeune is back in our number one spot. I am personally shocked to see how many cases are still out there. I think for a while, many firms were really concerned with oversaturation in the market. Of course, you always have to deal with this possibility that some of these leads are going to be already represented by another firm, but our clients are still seeing a really great result, especially as the statute inches closer. Weight loss injections have made their way up to number five. This tort is seemingly getting a lot of the spotlight most recently. It accounts for the bulk of the inquiries that we've seen over the past month or two. Firms are getting stricter with their criteria and almost none of them are accepting those non-brand drugs. We are going to continue to see this in our top 10 and there's that inevitable spring rush in April. So if you're excited about Ozempic, my recommendation would be to get in now. We have been running PowerPort campaigns since 4Q of last year. So it's really exciting to see this one on our top 10 list for the first time. This one alleges that Bard knew about migration and fracturing from their PowerPort devices. We will obviously continue to track competitive spending and let you know how this tort develops. I have the privilege of meeting with so many different people in various situations week over week, and I love matching you all with the right strategies and the right litigating firms to help you reach your goals. Please feel free to contact me if you wanna learn more about any of these torts or you have any others that you're interested in.